Hi, I'm Abhishek. I'm Abhishek. Hi, I'm Ipan. The objective of our project is to explore, evaluate and compare different ways of interaction between the student and a virtual model in a virtual dissection process. Traditional way of dissecting the product with a keyboard or a mouse results in low self-efficacy. Therefore, the end product of our project is to develop a set of gestures that are most intuitive and natural for students to use in order to improve their self-efficacy in the virtual dissection process. And our project first starts with brainstorming activities. In the series of brainstorming session, we identify the resource, requirement, and constraint of the project. Then, we create a mind map of the problem. We put every positive idea on the board. In the end, we design a structured plan of how to develop gestures. To understand what kinds of gestures are intuitive during dissection, we looked at how students perform the physical dissection activities. We asked participants to dissect three products of various level of complexity. Telephone, which is a simple product. A Nerf gun, which is of average complexity. And a solar robot, which is of high level of complexity. Based on our observation, we developed hierarchical task analysis for each product dissection to understand how product of different complexity could pose different requirements and constraints on the physical dissection activity and on the gestures. We segmented virtual dissection activity in three steps. First, we briefed participants about the study and gathered information about their experience with product dissection and challenges they observed in physical dissection process via informal interviews. In second step, we asked participants to develop gestures for 14 different tasks used in virtual dissection. Lastly, participants were asked to dissect the products virtually using gestures they developed in first step. I think of getting small and zooming it in, spreading my hands out as like a picture. Okay. And I think of also iPhones, like you use this gesture for zooming in. So okay. that's probably what I'm used to. Thank you.